Yo, hi and welcome. My name is Dan Nero, and we're back with Fire Emblem Free Houses. In the last episode, we uh, watched support. No, oh, yeah, we did those two side quests, right? Uh, best of the best, and whatever it was called. All right, before we do anything, um, I recruited Chamir into our lines, into our groups. No, how do you call that? Into our something. Did I not? Did I not class change them all? I don't know. Anyway, uh, let's not focus on that. Let's watch some supports first before we do anything. Pedro and Dorothea, let's go. Oh, I have to turn up the volume a little because I can't hear anything. I don't remember what their first support was about, by the way. みんなは貴族の跡取りだったり出世を望む野心家だったりしたものね。視界が… ここでいろんな男に声をかけて、いい人がいないか探してるのよ。玉の腰。宝石座る。ですか。まあ、腰とかリトリー。ぼんやりわかります。まあ、大体合ってるわね。ミスタークラブスディスアプローブ。あなた
なたに悪気がないのはわかる。わかっているのだけれど。And let's. Now we are returning to. So that didn't went anywhere. All right, good. Ferdinand, Caspar, your last support. Come on, and on a high note, please. Ferdinand, じゃないか。待ってたって。何？君に本当の正義を教えてやろうと思ってね。本当の正義だ。俺の正義は偽物だって言うのかよ。それはまだわからないさ。先日、君は町で強盗を捕まえたと聞いた。それも、老人が営む店に現れた強盗を。だ。まさかとは思うが、店で暴れてはいまいな。おいおい、それは俺を舐めすぎだぜ。強盗が現れやがった時、店のじいさん、腰抜かしちまってよ。そんなんでさらに俺が暴れたら、じいさん気絶しちまうかもしれねえだろう。だから強盗に俺の金を渡してやったんだ。今日はこれで勘弁しろよってな。No, what? 君とは思えない首相な行動だな。そしたら強盗のやつ、店から出てってくれたんだぜ。まあ、店から出た後にすぐ追っかけて、とっちめてから金は取り戻したんだが。Okay. Eseshio. <laughs> あれは町で露店を見ていた時だった。明らかに粗悪な品を並べる店があってな。調べようとした矢先に、どこかの貴族の紙幣が天使を捕らえて引きずっていこうとした。普通に考えれば、質の悪い部分を売った天使を捕まえたという状況なのだろうが、どうしたことか、私は思わず天使を助け、兵士たちをのしてしまったのだ。やるじゃねえか。気分上がりそうだな、それ。そういう問題ではない。とにかく、その後で店主に事情を聞くと、どうもその店主は素人で、貴族に騙されて粗悪な品を売っていたようなのだ。それが発覚しそうになり、貴族は口封じのため兵士を送り込んだということらしい。あれってそういう話だったのか。お前が貴族の部下をいきなり殴ったって聞いたから、俺はてっきり。いや、そこは否定すまい。私は totally not because I'm a racist or anything. No. 本能に従ってしまったのだ。それのどこが悪いんだよ。俺に似てきたんじゃねえか？君の方こそ私に似てきたのでは。強盗を捕まえた時に見せたという配慮。以前のように本能に任せず、Could it be that I am you when you are me? 案外、俺たちはお互いのいいところを吸収したりしてんのかもな。共に正義を追求し、互いに高め合う二人、燃えてきたぜ。正義を追い求める相棒か。まあ、そういうことにしておいて。Ferdinand、Ferdinand、Ferdinand。Okay, um, good. I think that is it. Yep, except the boys who I have to wait for. Oh, I just now noticed that. Man, why do I have to wait for her like every single time? Come on. Okay, um, yeah, as I said off screen, I recruited Chamia. Um, try to recruit Catherine as well, but didn't get the option. Just like with civil, and that is when I remembered that. Oh, I have to repair that sword. I just noticed. All right, I'm gonna do that off screen later. And that bow too. I don't know. Um, yeah, that is when I remembered that we are that in order to play the church uh, route, you have to play the black eagle route, and which I, I guess. 
means that at some point I have to choose to continue playing Black Eagles or Church. And yeah, it doesn't really make sense to recruit Cyril and and uh, Catherine who are really devoted to Rhea. And yeah, doesn't make sense because I'm thinking that in this route we're gonna go up against the church because that is what always happened in the other routes so yeah that is why yeah it doesn't make sense that we can recruit like Cyril who really likes Rhea or Catherine who is really devoted to Rhea so yeah it kind of makes sense but does that mean that we're gonna not uh, get Setif at some point because he's like the advisor right but at the same time we have flames so i don't know like that that is actually kind of interesting is he gonna go with us because we have flame in our team or does he go with Rhea because he's still the advisor of Rhea or something i don't know so i don't know i don't want to have i don't want to know the, those answers of course because i'm gonna get there anyway at some point so please don't spoil that for me and yeah um as you can see you already probably noticed i got two side quests now yeah i kind of locked out here because um i recruited charmia and after recruiting her i unlocked the paralog that yeah you can play with her so yeah that is actually pretty lucky because i have two activity points and that means that I don't have to like do one, uh, do this one, and then skip. But instead, I can just do two battles at once, right after each other. So yeah, um, that makes good. I'm not wasting any activity points like that. And I'm gonna say we're starting with this one, Sword and Shield of Saros, which is, I mean. The way I do things is I like to save the best for last always and we already already played this mission twice in two separate routes so I might as well do this one first the other one I played as well on the blue lines run but yeah only once so yeah what's going on here i don't really care what happens here yeah. oh you know what i'm gonna skip that we've seen this uh pirates we've seen this like twice already so if you want me to watch those cutscenes and watch my blue lines and my golden deer run uh, i may let's go like we played this mission two times already so yeah the rundown is like there's a town that we have to defend from pirates and yeah alois and shamia go and deal with that and that's it like if you want me to react to the story and talk about the story and all that then go to my blue lines one or golden deer run i think i actually named those parts after this mission sword and shield of Saros. so not really uh hard to miss so yeah let me just go and do this really quick Okay, this is Bastion. I remember there being um, some Vivan riders that always make it into town before I can deal with them. So, which means I'm gonna put Bernadetta and Shamia in the middle here. Probably, maybe. Okay, there's also a Lois who is level 16 yeah, and who is pretty strong so yeah I think the reinforcements here is 
just keep coming i think there was something like that right i think it just keeps coming and coming and coming and coming until i defeat the boss if i remember correctly all right i do the preparations off screen because i'm kind of worried that i missed something i don't know if i did maybe i forgot to reclass or did some certification with people i don't know i'm just gonna check a little bit so yeah i'll see you in a second and we're done yeah i have the exact same amount of people that i can bring in this map which is pretty good for once normally i'm stuck with like one two three spaces that i can't deploy because the lack of students or other people so yeah Dorfia supports Leonard and Caspar supports Shamia. Um, I'll say we'll go. I also did not forget anything. Already prepared myself in the last episode. So you're gonna burn this town down anyway. やっかいなことになっているようだな。子供だましの貼ったりだ。が、商人を脅すには有効らしい。I think I already looked. I should have looked that up. <laughs> oh, they can't get. Oh, right. Well, if the pirates get in the town and remain for a total of five turns, you will have to fight your mission. And yeah, I think you only. <clears throat> I think if some turns, if you let them in here for some turns, then they, uh, yeah. Then you lose out on on a uh, oh, what's it called reward? Come on, it's not what. Okay, um, those people are not strong, right? My plan was to kill this guy so that someone can block this area first. Uh. But how do I do that? Brought all my heavy hitters minus gosh dang it Edelgard. What? Okay, um can I do this? That doesn't kill. Well it's okay. Yes, I'm gonna put Edelgard over here. Then she wow she's killing this guy easily i should have put her over there she has a lot of defense after all what am i doing here okay oh that's gonna be okay thank you okay instead ferdinand is over here i could have moved another what i did not count that much okay um i guess you're just gonna go over here let me give you some wait are you no okay flying you're gonna go over here you're gonna go over here because i know there are people coming from over here at some point so yeah vibe riders so let's go um meanwhile can we kill stuff from over here if everyone can kill something that would be really nice you can kill this guy i forged her an iron bow a better one she cannot kill this guy that sucks okay maybe she activates adapt uh, not adapt never yeah, that skills called the crest That's No, I could also. Don't I have? Yeah. Ah. That is not good. 
Oh, oh, so not good. Okay, um, I mean, they seem to prioritize attacking us instead of actually going in there, so that's good. She has X breaker now, that's also good. Still got hit. What? 25%. Come on. We're gonna block your path. You're not gonna get killed by this guy, right? 13. No. But you are damn close. Boom. Okay. Well, this is gonna be. We'll manage somehow. Like the difficult to spike up, like just a teeny tiny bit but oh yeah the parallax are harder than the story missions just remember they tend to be harder for some reason okay uh, you probably know nope, you don't die oh come on don't take away my experience Great, you took away my experience, you stupid idiot. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Ow. Thank goodness Hubert is over there. And now those guys have to take it. Oh. Like, those guys move in a way that I can't even get them. For they... Like, at least get one hit in. So yeah, that kind of sucks. I mean, she could use like dead eye. Oh, come on. Uh, uh, okay. Still going after her, it seems. Oh. You what you need to heal Petra, just saying. And you need like luck, speed. Okay, it's also good. Oh, no, oh my god, this is actually not good. Why? Oh my god, they are doubling her. Oh, what? How? Um, we are probably dead now. I mean, yeah, we are. Wait, how am I supposed to save that? Why is she getting doubled? 14 attack speed. What? Huh? Why they so damn fast? Okay, um, hmm. Oh, God, what do we do here? What's the hit chances? Seventy seven levels brutally. I need to actually redo this. But she can attack from what? I'm Petro. What are the hit chance against you? Not good. But how are they so strong? <laughs> you should not get doubled wow how am i supposed to i have to actually okay here's what we do why are you going after her okay we'll take care of this guy a curve shot And well, um, 
Hubert is not getting doubled, but if we if they both attack him, then yep, he's dead. Um, wow. Okay, wait, we can do this. All right. Okay. How did this end up so bad all of a sudden? Okay, we kind of need to defeat this guy. Uh huh. 32. That is. Can we. So why is this so hard? Do we actually have to rely on vulnerary ten? That is not gonna heal enough. I have to prey on dodging. Actually, it's the only thing we can do here. What the heck? Okay, speed defense yeah and 31 hit chance that is not gonna work out can Lenard reach you no come on gonna be freaking kidding me I thought I had a lot of control over here but no oh yeah she learned some attack magic finally so that's good okay um what oh i mean yeah we can do this or we can put edelgard over there okay i need to kill this guy there we go uh, uh. You know, this all doesn't even matter because if like uh Petra doesn't survive that one hit, she doesn't dodge it, then yeah, that all doesn't really matter, yeah. And so far this game was not really oh really this game was not really generous. When it comes to like letting me actually i don't know hit stuff or dodge stuff when it actually matters it's a comet art it's been a long time i know and now you Both. This guy's done now. This guy, um, tank speed four, seven, defense ten, thirty two, and it's not gonna kill. Awesome, that's what I like to see. All right, Petra, this all turn is depending on you. Just saying, okay. okay. I always managed to dodge with 35, so 31. Thank you. Uh -huh. Okay, this situation down there taken care of. Oh my god, I forgot to repair a ball. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Yes, okay. Petra, you need to be healed. Uh, uh -huh. Okay. Um. Yeah, we somehow managed to survive this with luck only. I don't rely. I don't like relying on luck, but yeah. Why not? Lenard, you go and heal her as well been really nice if you were there like a minute ago okay you didn't even hit this guy 
Oh yeah, because Gambit. I forgot. Let's do this. God, he does take a lot of damage. Doesn't even get like support points. Wow. Okay. Um. Would like to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Oh God. This guy's not gonna. Nope. Ah. Oh. Can't reach anyone. Ah. Oh. Hmm. Do you have shop? Should have shop, right? Yeah. Boom. There we go. Man, this area is a lot easier if the archer is not around. No, don't go after Ferdinand from big here. Because he's gonna attack back. Oh no. Okay, am I not allowed to recruit Alois as well? Because he's not getting support points. Am I allowed to... To, like, uh, get anyone? It's a huge waste of physics, but okay. Okay, it doesn't seem like as if there are people coming over here. Yeah. Oh, they are totally gonna get over here. I'm just gonna prepare everyone for this moment. I know they're gonna come down here and attack. Uh, should I? I'm gonna lure those people out with Petra. Okay, this guy. The one perfect. Three hits. Thank you. Doesn't get. All right. It kind of sucks. Like, come on, how am I supposed to get support points with this guy? I think she only got two stats out of each battle so far. I'm just imagining things here. Oh, this guy. Uh probably take care of them can I attack can I kill you with a tempest lance I sure can and the enemies are hard enough for me to having used having to use my steel lance can't believe it Destroy this guy, please. Oh, yep. Yep. Okay. I was about to kill him anyway, so thank you. Okay. What's that? No. Those stupid gambits away from me. There they are. I was wondering why they were about to move. When they were about to move. Only one of them. Uh -huh. If I remember correctly, then those guys. Oh wow! With an iron ball, she's not able to double. She has close counter, so okay. We cannot stop this guy from getting in here, so might as well. Oh, and do this. No one really. Okay, just when I was about to get in here with Petra, they of course run away. Might uh, they not go down here? You too, you but 
schauen wir ein bonner der two archers against some wyvern lords no problem oh this guy can whatever this bonk quest of flames too bad that we are not getting any support points because everyone's like oh, i have to oh, i have to wait like for something to happen until we can talk again bonk <laughs> my headphones Okay, um, yep, should be fine. Hmm. Oh, oh, that's that Viber Nord, right? Viber right, I mean, Viber Lord. Oh God. Okay. Line is next to him, then yeah, he will take less damage. Should have checked out her battalion. Okay, how stupid is the AI in this game? Like, he was landing right in front of me. You think he would attack? No. Come on, that is just stupid. It's this guy that reached me. Oh my god. Oh, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Ah, I can't touch you. Let me just Google something really quick. Rewards and all that. Because I don't really know. I think I actually looked that up last time as well. The end of the chapter. I've never remained in different area for four turns. Less than four turns. And less than four turns. Okay. Well, okay. I don't even get like really rare battalions or stuff from all of this. That kind of sucks. Oh, now you're gonna attack. Oh, but you're gonna double, right? Well, then let's get away a little bit and let Shamia take care of them. Oh, wow. Like I'm not imagining this, right? There are a lot of people getting only two stats constantly. Okay. Oh yeah, she gets buffed up. Because of her personal skill. Alright, Petra, I know there's no one down there anymore. Because they all decide to go up. I think that was like a thing always when i played this map so yeah um oh, they're all using gamuts that's why they or oh, they don't oh wait let me use a yeah aha gamut rules. how does that even activate i thought it activated if they have like support levels or anything but those two don't have supports. Oh, that was really good. I just noticed. Those two don't have support points. Supports. So far. So how does that work? Uh, let's him get down here first. Oh. Oh, you can't even kill. Dang it. Okay, then let's put Edelgard over here. 
Yep. Honk. And level up. We are gonna be a little bit too higher leveled by doing those parallax before the eagle and lion battle, I think. Oh. Yep. Jeez. I have a crest and I mentioned that. It activates three, two, three, four, six, eight, nineteen times in a row. Okay, this guy. Wow, they're all going after Ilgard. Oh wow, there are a lot of people going after Ilgard. <laughs> but it's fine. You can take it actually. Surprisingly, she's like the. What? This guy moves since when? What? <laughs> Since when does this guy move? I remember this guy being stationary in the other routes. This one horse just jumped back to dodge. Man, Ilgard's like that traditional armored lord that you have in other Fire Emblem games. Oh wow. Like Hector from Fire Emblem 7. Big dude with an axe and armor can send him into whole armies. He's gonna destroy every single one of them. So yeah, that's what Ilgard looks to be, or Ike from Fire Emblem: Map of Radiance and Radiant Dawn. Oh god, that other guy was not in range, right? Again, also a character that you can just send into armies and he just kills everything. Like no joke, because he does so much damage and doesn't take any damage. Oh wow, more Wyvern riders. Yeah, I get it. I'm working on that. I'm working on it. And there are always lords that turn into mounted units. We don't have any of those. I mean, we have Claude who can get a. Uh, Wyvern, but we don't have like a mounted unit on a horse, which usually is a thing in most Fire Emblem games. Yeah, she won't be able to reach anything anyway, so they normally start out as like some boring sword wielding lord, then they get like a horse, and yeah, we can take care of this guy now that I think about it. 86 hit. She has a void of 45, then she gets 20 avoid. That means she gets 65 avoid. If this guy comes after us and we put her into here, then she can stall this guy like forever. That could work. Then again, there are a lot of people over here. Excuse me. Why am I not doing that much damage to this guy? Survivor. Why do they have so much magic resistance? Die? All right. Now I have to take care of the archers because they are getting really strong. Okay. Um. Oh wow. Yes. Do this killer. Gambit. All right. That took care of some stuff. Oh, oh yeah. Um, oh no. Wait. The archer can still hit her. We move her over here. Then that gauntlet guy can hit her. Dang it. Also, if I use. I have to use a gamut over here as well. Mm, yep. Let's do this. Put a hold to some of those people. You know, this guy cannot attack actually. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. 
luck plus eight that would be good oh God. I need to move away here you know what uh gambit oh that's not gonna well actually that's pretty good plus kill guard I'm pretty sure that she will not get damaged that that bad anyway, but whatever. Okay, Petra. Yeah, I hope this guy keeps coming after us because the AI is a little bit weird sometimes. It doesn't go after the people who are actually closer to you but yeah i don't know you know what continuing on what i was saying before uh dimitri actually fits into this like normal lord class starts out as a unit without a mount and then as the story progresses he gets one i mean now that i think about it there are actually not many lords who turn into mounted units i think like uh yeah they are actually in the minority now that i think about it like marv is like on foot uh and there's roy is also on foot like leaf from five and five is on foot arm is on foot celica is on foot my emblem two uh oh god and this is a little bit scary here I'm sure Edelgard can actually take care of it. I would like to get those archers, please. They are pretty annoying. Uh, can I get this brawler? Yeah, but then everyone is gonna attack him. Yeah, I'm gonna send him over there. I'm gonna lock him up a little bit. No support points at all. And we're gonna send him in here he's gonna get the training gauntlets and he's gonna be fine i mean there are a ton oh yeah he's more than fine like what am i even worried about he feel something ill i mean unless they are not walking over here i think everything will be fine okay this guy we are moving closer to the forest a little bit if you don't mind Those three should be enough to take care of this guy, right? I don't like the ex experience distribution in this chapter so far. I don't think I'm spending my experience as good as I could be. Uh -huh. I would like to counter attack all of you. Wow. Steel gauntlets. One damage training goal. That's ten. That's a little bit sad. Nope, they are not going to the. I think I'm already missing out on some. On some uh, rewards because there are a lot of turns. They were in there for a lot of turns. No, not Firefox Chrome. Not. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you know what? I would like to get 100%. Thank you very much. What do I get? At the end of the chapter. If enemies remained in the defense area less than four turns. I mean, they add up, right? That is probably that was like three turns so far i think 
so I'm missing out on a seraph rope. Ugh. I don't really use those stat booster items anyway, so it actually doesn't matter now that I think about it. So yeah, um, I'm missing out on some stat boosters probably. Yep, thank you. But it really doesn't matter because I don't use them anyway, like at all. I haven't used a single one so far, unless when I try to grind some S rank supports at the end, where I have to redo like the final mission like five times or something. All right, god dang it, why does this one guy have to be attacks before? What? Okay, a steel ball. I was about to say. What is your two? Oh, you're not gonna get doubled then. All right, cool. And a forty E plus. Already, already mastered a battalion. Okay, you, you're standing dangerously close to the left. Don't want you to get to town. Like, oh wait, I can just barge in there. No one is gonna stop me. No, 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 no. Okay, now we can just put her in here, and she's gonna dodge for days. I'm, I'm uh, curious to see how much the hit chance of this guy is gonna be now. Level 15, Leonard. All right, I think Ilgard can actually sit out the next paralog because she's level 17 already. All right, show me <laughs> zero. <laughs> That's what I expected. Yeah, oh, everything worked out exactly as I planned. Ouch. Oh, thank you. Actually, goes after someone could appreciate some levels. B rank on lances, ward breaker, awesome. Because there's another one of those. Ah. Oh. I think I'm gonna kill the boss a little bit earlier than usual. Okay. Not fair to no. Okay. Oh, you actually double. Awesome. Or maybe Alois doesn't get support points because he already has like enough with Bailiff, with Bailiff. That could be it, right? All right. Wow, she's destroying this guy. Okay, can, can someone of you please help out? I mean, she can actually take off this guy on her own, so whatever. Let's go, Petra. Boom. Did almost see no combat at all, but oh, you're going after him. You go after him instead. Okay. Um, yep, he's just ignoring me. Nope, let's just kill this boss then. Hey, please stay over here. Okay, fair enough. You should be able to kill this guy, right? Maybe get some experience. I should have done that too far. What am I doing? Man, having to use another game. Shadow Slash. Hmm. All right. 
and you're dead. Didn't even get support points. Come on. Okay, we could give this kill to Petra or one of you guys. No, you're gonna heal. Get some experience like that. So Petra, boom. destroy him. Crit? No. Okay, wasn't there like? Oh, I forgot. Was there someone I could steal something? I think one of those people had like a vulnerary or a concussion. That's about it. Successfully protected the town. Okay, what do we get? Large bullion. Sarah rope. All right. Uh, okay, we get a bullion. Ferdinand from Iggy. Okay, we get a bullion if. Boom. All right, that was actually pretty short. So let's go. Okay, let me just look at the uh, side for a moment. Automatically at the end of the chapter, if enemies remained in the defense area for four turns, large bullion is what you get if they don't. But less than four turns, yeah. Less than four turns. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. I'm just dumb. I couldn't count. Of course, that was less than four. It was good training. <laughs> I don't really care about that. I can't accept this. Whoa. Everyone is happy. I don't know. We've seen this already. All right. I'm gone. <laughs> Out of context, this is so. This is so stupid. Okay. Well, yeah. Sorry that I had to skip a little bit of this, but I'm not gonna skip anything here. But yeah, we've seen this uh, paralog a few times already. Oh, that, that that's why he wasn't getting any support points because he was maxed out for now. That explains it. Oh, those two got one. Oh. Him and Shamia, that's also good. Okay, well, did I learn something? No, what did I learn today? I don't know. Hmm. Why did I give him a trailing lens? I don't know, doesn't matter. Okay, um, we got some brilliance and what's it called? Seraph rope, which I will not use anyway, so yeah, that's good. Okay, good. That was pretty fast, pretty easy, I think. And in the next episode, we're gonna do it a little bit more professional with watching the cutscenes and all that because it's been like one playthrough away since I seen this cutscene. So yeah, we might as well watch it instead of the one that we just did, where which we have seen like three times already with this one. So yeah, okay. Um, that's it for this part. Please consider leaving a like, a comment, or subscribe if you like this. And yeah, I'll see you in the next episode again. Bye bye.